really passionate about the ways people communicate with one another and how they collaborate and how trust is created and how do you create a sense of family through reshaping business space. I'm from Toronto. I grew up there in Canada and after writing my undergraduate thesis my goals changed and I didn't really want to do academia anymore and I didn't really want to go for that master's program right away so I initially became a chef. It's a particularly brutal, brutal lifestyle but honestly I have never had a stronger sense of family than the people I worked with on the line in a kitchen. You're in a cramped space, there's not a lot of room, you know it really forces you to really get along with the people that you work with because if you don't, it just explodes. My time working as a chef, it is really quite applicable, especially here where Milano isn't like a very typical management program. You're not here to learn about economic models necessarily, although that is involved. You're here to learn about how people operate and why organizations work the way they do, and I think that you get a very extremely advanced microcosm of what that looks like in a kitchen because it is so intense all the time. I think Devin's experience is interesting because he has both technical skills in terms of thinking about you know finance or operations but he's very in tune with the human side of organizations and it's become really clear in recent years that MBA education only focuses a little bit on the human side of the way in which organizations operate and the change management focus is really putting the humans at the center of what organization life is about. There was distributive leadership, right? The organizational change management, it's kind of part institutional psychology and it's part learning about group process. It's all about being able to facilitate conversation. Like it's really learning about who you are as a person in order to help others around you. In order to be effective in any group setting, you have to know who you are in that context. At the new school, students are particularly in touch with their own values. They don't want to separate their work from who they are. They bring who they are into the way in which they shape their work. And you know, we think that's the future of leading the country out of this crazy set of organization crises that we've been seeing over the last few years. Through talking to various professors here, I really rediscovered my passion and my path. And I really know what I want to do, and I'm really trying to make that happen.